Hi, I'm Francis, the host of this show, Cooking with the Dog. こんにちは。今日は皮がパリッパリ、中はジューシーな焼き餃子を作ります。Let's prepare the ingredients for 餃子 Cut the cabbage leaf into strips. Chop them into small pieces. Shown here are about one eighth inch pieces. Slice the onion wedges but leave the root part attached. Chop the onion into small pieces. These would also be one eighth inch pieces. Chop the garlic chive stems first. Next, cut the leaf parts in half and chop them into fine pieces. Grate the garlic clove and the ginger. Let's make the filling for gyoza. Knead ground pork in a bowl until a bit gooey. Add soy sauce, sugar, pepper, sake, sesame oil, potato starch, grated garlic and ginger, and oyster sauce to the ground pork. Knead the mixture thoroughly. This thickness is ideal for giving the filling a juicy texture when cooked. Add chopped cabbage, onion, and garlic chives to the mixture. Lightly stir until evenly mixed. Cover the bowl with a plastic wrap. Keep the mixture in a fridge for 30 minutes so the pork and the vegetables blend well together. Let's wrap the fillings. Sprinkle some flour on a baking sheet. This will give gyozas extra crispness. Scoop the fillings and spread onto gyoza skins. Wet the edges of gyoza skins. Fold the skins in half and begin forming pleats only one side. Place gyozas on the baking sheet. This is one example of how to wrap the fillings and you can arrange it as you like. Let's make gyoza sauce. Put black vinegar and soy sauce in a bowl. Stir lightly. Let's cook gyoza. Heat sesame oil in a frying pan over medium heat. Line up half of gyozas in the pan. Pour over boiling water until they are half covered. Put the lid on and cook over medium high heat for about 5 to 6 minutes. When the water has evaporated and gyoza starts to sizzle, add some more sesame oil between gyoza and replace the lid. Cook for 1 to 2 minutes more. When the bottoms of gyoza become golden brown, remove gyoza with a spatula. Serve gyoza bottom side up on a plate. This recipe can be a great side dish for ramen noodles. Add rayu or sesame oil to gyoza sauce according to your taste. パリッパリに焼けました。美味しいです。Uncooked filling will easily go bad, so do not leave it in the fridge for long. Good luck in the kitchen!